All right, so check this out. A serendipitous moment at its finest. February 11th, 2020, I get a message from my little sister, Christine, saying that my friend, who I grew up with, was only two hours away in Zermatt, Switzerland. I was currently in Maribel, France with my buddy Chris snowboarding, and once I heard of the news, I absolutely had to book a trip over to go see them. Now, Paula, which is Mikey's mother, taught me in, uh, in catechism class back when we were kids and growing up in church together. So we have great history together. We always grew up having a great time uh, going on different adventures. And I hardly ever talk to this guy, Mikey, but when we get together, we have an absolute blast. So thanks to Christine for seeing this me message and then sending it to me. Thank you to Paula for putting the pictures online so that Christine could see it. And thanks to both Paula and Mikey for inviting me into your mother-son um, vacation and helping me uh, get this experience here in Zermatt that was absolutely fantastic and something that I can't wait to do again. So, enjoy the video, but I just want to let you know that serendipitous moment was so incredible that I had to share it with you all. Enjoy! Just got into the train. It's from Maribel, France, and uh, so now I'm going to see Mikey and his mom Paula. And uh, where are we going? We are going to Zermatt. That's right. Uh, so I came from Maribel, which is known for the heart. Uh, the Snow Valley is right in the center. Since we have no place to go, let it snow. Good. <laughs> oh, was fantastic. All right. Allow me to introduce myself, everybody. My name is. What is Allow my name? Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is DJ Gache. Gache. Oh, I'm tired. This is Mikey, also known to the ladies. Mike. Mike Fox here. And Mama Fox killing it! 68 years old and killing it. Skiing six days in a row, man. Super awesome. With the matter horn right behind her and the train going by. Doesn't get much better than this. Alright, so I want to give you a quick scoop of what is happening right here. So, my only DJ Rose invited me to play with him here in Zermatt, Switzerland. I came in asking for a job <laughs> and he's like, you know what bloke? Come on Saturday and we're gonna make this happen. So thanks to Mr. DJ over here. I'm here hanging out having a good time. 
one human family. There we go. Yeah. Get your biscuits in the kitchen. I'm a sous chef on a mission. Baby, wiggle it. It's vicious. We about to break the dishes. Got the pepper with the sodium. We cooking with petroleum. Come step up to the podium and cut up this linoleum. So Mikey and I are hanging out at this, uh, sorry, Mike. <laughs> Come on, give me this frame. There we go. So, that guy is Mikey. And we are uh, hanging out at the Backstage Hotel, which takes you through a Michelin four-star restaurant with servings of food that I can't even explain. I can't even tell you what it even looks like because there's so much going on. And there's this amazing artist. What's the artist's name? I don't remember. <laughs> His name is, I don't remember. And he builds these incredible chandeliers. And not only that, he's a painter as well. He's an architect, I would call him an architect. And um, his stuff is absolutely everywhere and amazing. And that's what we're gonna show you because I think not only is the Matterhorn amazing and the skiing is amazing, but the architecture and attention to detail, as well as the, the level of hospitality. I'm telling you, these people are very, very proud of what they do. And we gotta show this to you because this place is incredible. Anything to say, Mike? Thank you so much. Alright, so check this out. Thank you, Donito. See you next time, man. <laughs> Bye. You can hush my mellow, my dude, I'm trying to tell you. To tamper with this just ain't right. Good, right? Yeah, Perfect. Yeah. Nice. yeah. One human family. Yeah. So I find it. Uh, USA, one human family dot info. Ah, yeah. Key West. Ah, yeah. That sounds good. <laughs> <laughs>
And that is how you get your drinking water. All right, so just to give you a little, a uh, little bit of education of what we're what we're in right now is an electric car. That is the only uh -huh. type of vehicle allowed here in Zermatt. The buses are electric. The taxis are electric. No one is allowed to have um, vehicles of their own. They must get there through uh, bicycle, skateboard, or walking. So right now we are getting a taxi back from our hotel Jägerhof over to the train station. So. You don't smell fuel in this town. It's super awesome, nice and quiet, and very charming, like everything else in this town. Chickens here. Today is the last day of, uh, of my trip here in Zermatt, and uh, I think it's a really, really good time to reflect because this place is, has taught me that no matter where you are in the world, we are all humans, and all we want is feel loved, feel connected, and to, uh, to be appreciated amongst each other. And I want to thank you, Zermont, for giving me such a beautiful experience. Uh, DJ Rose, especially to you for uh, just kind of taking me under your wing immediately and uh, showing me what, the, what this town is all about because you're a truly a special human and I, I forever thank you for, for everything. And everybody else, Caesar, for letting me DJ with you yesterday, and Hans, and your awesome character, and everybody else. Uh, we'll be back for sure, absolutely, hundred percent sure. Uh, Zermatt, I'll be back for you. What is it you love about Zermatt so much? Zermatt is beautiful, beautiful uh, hotel. Only in Portuguese is is uh, primeiro. Primeiro, as boas montanhas que temos aqui em Zermatt. E tudo de bom. Awesome. Thank Obrigado. You. Obrigado. <laughs> thank you so much. Bye, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, absolutely. Okay. All right. Thank you. Arrivederci. Arrivederci. <laughs> All right, if you start walking. We were passing time, getting high with the best friends. Living life, eating vibe, learning lessons. Didn't need no struggle, we were good for life. We didn't need no place to rest. Our awfully burdened heads. Back then the air was fresh, and we were good for life. We were just kids. So we were just kids. It is what it is, we were good for life. over the wings and two front doors. Path marking will find your way to the exits. For additional safety information, including emergency exit location and evacuation procedures, please read the safety car location. 